Hello, good evening. Gemara Masechet Yoma says as follows: Tanu Rabanan, vidkashtem videm kedushim, that we should sanctify ourselves in order that we are holy. Look at the Gemara says, very interesting. Adam mekadesh atzmo meat. A person adds a little bit of kedusha to his life. Mekadshim oto harbe. From Shemayim Hakadosh Baruch Hu will help him to help himself sanctify himself and and be whole, even holier. Milimata, if a person sanctifies himself here in this world, mikatshin oto milimala, in Shemayim, they also give him that reward and that help to be even more holy. One more. Ba'olam mazeh, mikatshin oto le'olam haba. A person who sanctifies himself in this world will be sanctified and holy forevermore in olam haba. <coughs> On this concept, the Baal HaTanya, this is a very interesting concept. It says, that we have a promise from HaKadosh Baruch Hu that we will beat our Yetzer Hara. However, we have to understand that it's always going to be a fight. He says, he brings from the, from the verse, Yishlach Ezrecha Mikodesh. That HaKadosh Baruch Hu always give and send his help for Varim Shebitusha, anything that res- uh, resembles or has to do with sanctity and holiness, and Hashem will give help for that. However, a person has to understand that it will always be a fight. The Yetzirah sees a person uh, helping himself, doing more in, 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 in making himself holier and sanctifying himself. Yetzirah will attack the person, make it harder for him. The person has the one moment of, 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 of growth, a day of growth, Yetzirah will attack and make it harder and harder. But that's fine. We have to understand the way Yetzirah works. We spoke about this last week that the only way to beat it is slowly, slowly, every situation, every moment that we beat it set up, we're putting him in our pocket and controlling it. We can't let the fact that he beats us once in a while to let us completely give up. The Gra, the Gaumi Vilna says something. It's very interesting to quote the Balatanya after the Gra. It completely did not get along, but it's fine. Baruch Hashem, it's Torah. The Gaumi Vilna says, that everything, so to say, is decided for us in Shamayim. God has decreed exactly what will happen to each of us. There's only one thing that we can do, besides for fearing God, which is the only thing that we are able to decide. However, the, by the actions that we do, we prepare for whatever God has in store for us. The, only, the Gra explains that the only thing we have to do is the hachana, is the preparation. By us preparing to be happy, Hashem will send us happiness. By us preparing to be successful, Hashem will help us. We need to just prepare ourselves for the blessings, for the success, for everything good that Hashem, for the wisdom, for everything good that Hashem has for us, we just need to prepare for it and Hashem will send it. Same thing is by Kiddushah. We need to take our step in that direction and HaKadosh Baruch Hu will send, will send more. We'll end up with the last thought, and, and this is the, the, the concept that the Yetzer Hara is always attacking. And the Yetzer Hara wants nothing but to completely control a person. Sometimes we find ourselves in the middle of learning, in the middle of praying, in the middle of something, and all of a sudden something comes in our mind, something maybe inappropriate. The Yetzer Hara's whole goal is to completely take over a person's mind and lose concentration from the prayer. And, on the, and, and even worse, and think about things which are not clean. Think of things which, are not, which do not promote Kiddushah, sanctity and holiness. But we have to know that that's what, he, what the Yitzhara was created for, and we have the power to overcome it. It's always going to be the struggle in our minds. Think, think good things, think inappropriate things. But for us to know that we can overcome it, and that it's normal. Don't think that you're abnormal. It's normal. It happens to all. But what we know now is we've identified the problem. Now we have to work on trying to, to fix it. So Hashem HaKosh Baruch will help us with this, with the struggle, with this fight, which is something which adds to our sanctity and holiness, which brings us closer to HaKadosh Baruch Hu, just by being aware of it, and by, as obviously as what we're speaking about, is guarding our eyes as uh, as much as possible. Baruch Adonai Delam. Amen. Amen. Amen.